but the wheels beautiful man let me go ahead and show you guys exactly what they got done to it <laughs> you already know who it is man james Zachis tv hit that like comment subscribe to the channel j-a-t-v what is going on youtube it's your boy man james agus tv and thanks in advance for tap tap tapping in in today's vlog check this out you see the title you see the thumbnail i'm actually finally going to pick up my ca corvette this morning uh, from premier wheel repair um so irving has already sent me some images um and a small video of what it looks like so i kind of already know exactly what it looks like I want to tell you guys right now that the wheels are absolutely clean. They did an amazing job, but I'm not even going to talk too much in this intro. I'm just going to go ahead and get to the shop so you guys can see exactly what they did and how they repaired my wheel. And yeah, let's get this video on the road. So we've made it here to the shop. The car is outside, so the car got very, very dirty out here. Um, but the wheels beautiful man let me go ahead and show you guys exactly what they got done to them um let me actually go to the side with the damage first wow my car is really really dirty look at the job after it has been fixed and ceramic coated wow that is super clean now by the way like listen guys the car is so dirty but these wheels that is super clean. I haven't seen these wheels as clean since I got them put on. They cleaned up all the lines, all the faces of the wheels. Got that 4G Auto hopping. That is beautiful. Check out the back. Look at that. I believe the uh, product that the guy used was G Technique ceramic. They sent me images in the video. Look at that barrel. That is super clean, guys. I'm so excited to have these bad boys ceramic coated because now that cleaning process that I told you guys that I dreaded so much will now be so much easier to get done. How dirty the car is, though. Jesus. I don't know if this is even coming up on camera. Can y'all see that? It looks clean through this lens but I don't know if you guys can see how dirty this is look yeah big dirty at least it's not just outside in the element they did put it at least underneath the cover I guess Duh. for whatever protection that adds <laughs> super excited guys let me go and talk to the guy pay the guy and uh, I'll pick up this video in a second. All right, guys, so I'm about to get up out of here. Um, I've already paid the people. I'll let, you guys, I'll let you guys know exactly how much I paid for it once they get done. He has to retorque my, uh, my back uh, left rear tire. And uh, I'm actually gonna ask for a little bit more air as well. Hey, bro, can I also get some more air as well? A little more? Yeah. Okay. I wanna uh, get to at least 34 pounds yeah. of pressure. You need this? What is that? Uh, 30. Oh, this one? Too. Yeah, yeah. Huh. Okay. You need you need the wheel key? Uh, yeah. All set. Bro. Good. Thanks, bro. All right, guys, so he got me squared away on the air. Time for me to go ahead and roll off. Um, hopefully, he put all my wheel caps back on. Um, but yeah, let me go ahead and tell you exactly um, what the damage was. So to actually get the two wheels done, um, like I only needed the front wheel and the rear wheel. First off, if you're just now tuning into this video and you don't know what I'm talking about, go ahead and watch this video here. Um, I think it's on this side or this side. I just dropped the card somewhere below. Um, 
But long story short, I hit a pothole here in Atlanta and it messed up my wheels and I need to get my front wheel done and my rear, uh, my front right and my rear right wheel done. Uh, so it cost me, he only charged me $250 for the front right wheel. And um, because I wanted to go ahead and do the entire wheel on the back, because he wasn't going to charge me full price for the back, um, because the back only had a small nick of damage. I don't know. I might add the image to what it looked like on this video as well. But if I do it, it'll be like somewhere now. Yeah, so he wasn't going to charge me full price for the back. But I wanted him to go ahead and redo the entire wheel. I wanted to go ahead and have the whole entire wheel resurfaced and repainted because um, as I mentioned in my video, like maybe two, two videos ago, my car is gonna be in a very, very big car show and I want it to be right. And because I knew I was gonna get the wheel ceramic coated, I said, let me go ahead and invest the money to go ahead and get all of them done and done correctly, done right, and ceramic coated. Because I wasn't going to ceramic coat a wheel that was half done or, or a wheel that wasn't completely uh, fresh, I should say. So, that being said, um, it was $250 for the front right, $250 for the rear right, and then I had them redo the entire barrels. Um, which is the outside part of the wheel because it was peeling a little bit from the last paint job that I had. So I think he charged me only 175. Yeah, it was 175 for the front left and the and the and the rear left. So all together that was $850, if I believe. $350, 500 Yeah. So it was $850 for that. And then they don't actually do the ceramic coating themselves. They partner with a shop. Um, and I believe it was like Show Auto or something like that. I don't, I don't remember the, the guy's Instagram handle. Um, but he did a really good job on the ceramic coating, as you guys can see. And he only charged me $25 per wheel. And they use G Technique uh, ceramic coating um, products. So, yeah. All together, it was $950 to get this entire process done. So I take back what I said in my last video when I said that this wasn't going to be a $1,000 job. It actually ended up being $1,000 because I got more stuff done. And I got the I got the complete uh, wheel package done. So $950 later, here I am. Um, the guys were super professional. They got the job done. Um, and yeah. If I have any issues, I'll definitely let you guys know. Uh, but other than that, I highly recommend that you guys take your wheels there if you're in the Atlanta area. If you got some wheel damage, they do a lot of wheels, all different types of sizes. I think I've seen some 36s in there, all different types of sizes. And they also have the uh, the wheel guard protectors now um, that you guys have been seeing people like knock into your wheel. Um, really cool. So. I don't have anything else to say, man. If you guys are still tapped in, still watching right now, definitely go ahead and hit that like button and hit that subscribe button. Comment down below, like I said in my last video. Um, what are your worst wheel repair stories? I'm, I'm, I'm here to understand. I want to know what happened to you guys and what some similar situations, how you hit some potholes and how much damage did it take for you to actually, you know, as far as money wise, what it cost you to get your wheels done? Because I think I got a good deal, but you guys will let me know whether or not I got a good deal or not. Um, anyway, until next time, ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy, James Lackens TV. Thank you for watching. Thank you for tapping in. We out.